Hi, it's my time to shine. I will be covering the Libra reading. I want you to take what resonates and leave the rest. It's a general read. It's for entertainment purposes only, even though I get insight and always knew what been going on a long time in my life. But uh, without being sued from idiots, it's for entertainment purposes only. This will be for my Libras from the 16th of January to the 31st. This is a general reading. I'm not sure where they'll turn to. Because every time I try to just do a general, it goes to love, it goes to money, it goes to health. So whenever it turns to is what it turns to. The bottom of the deck is the Wheel of Fortune. Um, you know I tell it how it is. It's when the wheel go the opposite way. It's bad luck. Things not going in your favor. Things not going the way that you want them to go. That's your overall theme of your reading. Without further delay, I'm going to go ahead. Universe, my spirit guides, Holy Spirit, please clarify what you like, <clears throat> excuse me, the Libras to know. What do you have to tell the Libras? Mm. What do the Lib Libras need to know? What's going on with my Libras? What do you want to tell the Libras? Personally, what do you want to tell the Libras? What else do you got to tell my Libras? Universe Spirit Guide. Universe Spirit Guides. What do you have to tell my Libras? What do my Libras need to know for the 16th to the 31st? First card that came out is the Ten of Cups reversed where all your emotions are all over the place. Your family, home, everything is all upheld. This was your past position. So maybe in your past position, there was a lot of things going on that had your emotions all over the place because Libras kind of keep their emotions to themselves. You also got the, um, the Five of Swords. In your past, it was a victory. Somebody got tired of fighting or arguing with you, so they just put their swords down. You may won, but you didn't win a full victory because they gave up. You got the temperance reverse. The temperance reverse usually is a good card when it's upright um, position. It's usually when the universe is giving you a lot of love or whatever he's giving you and you got enough to put fill in another cup but you got it reversed so in your past you had frustration and people are working against you at cross purposes now for your present you got the high princesses reversed it's some deceit going out it's some secrets that's that's not all the way out there that yet that you may not know about it's something that's being hidden from you um it also it's instability, selfishness, and deception. So somebody is deceiving you in some type of situation. It could be job. It could be love. It could be friendship. It could be family. But it says wait and be patient because all will be revealed in due time. You also got, which, which is your sign, is the six of pentacles as far as the scales of your sign. Pentacles represent Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. Um, you're trying to weigh out your options. Basically, um, this could indicate a third-party situation. Or it could be you trying to help a couple people and you're not giving yourself nothing and you're still not able to balance. Because if you see one person getting three, you getting one and somebody else getting two and you got the scale and it's still not adding up right, perhaps because you can't, with six pinnacles, you can't really, and it's three people, it's kind of hard to balance that. You also got the star reverse, which means somebody's going to try to steal from you. Um... Somebody's not being honest with you about some situations because the upright, it means like, you know, hope and happiness and, you know, certain situations, but you got to start reverse. So it means for your future, you may face disappointments, perhaps to your own stubbornness and unfulfilling social or business association is coming to an end. 
good riddance. So basically you're dealing with something that's giving you stress. Maybe somebody you working for, maybe something that you're doing, but the ending is near and things ain't seeming right. And that's your present situation. You also got the two of cups to your future reverse. Now the two of cups upright means a union, happiness, togetherness, marriage, engagement, coming together in a business partnership. You got the two of cups, meaning your emotions is all over the place and it, and things is not going as you would like them to go. Um, maybe you want it to have be in a partnership with somebody, but somebody is not being honest. So it says a, a relationship has too many ups and downs, open the lines of communication and to avoid misunderstanding. So something may write in one of your relationships. And basically what this going on, it seems like this is a third party relationship, but I won't be able to tell that. Well, really with the three a, a, a wands is kind of basically what it is. You're waiting for your ships to come in. I don't know what you're waiting for, but you're waiting for your ships to come in. So basically, this represents a third-party situation. Um, compromise is necessary. You are negotiating from a position of strength. So something you negotiate and you know, and you're waiting for. But basically, you got your hand on one wand, and you looking, you're not even looking at the other two standing up. So you basically worry about the one person. And then you got the scales for your present, where there's three people, you and two others. So to me, it seemed like a third-party situation. Before I claim that, I'm going to go clarify the star. Wow. You seen that. You got the, the, the card I don't like, which... It's a good car and a bad car, but something was built a faulty foundation that's crumbling down right now. Something's coming down and it's it's coming bad and it's coming fast. You see that tower? Even the king and queen getting thrown out of that. Something is built on a faulty foundation, and this is your present. So right now, something was built and it probably was a relationship. Because I clarified the start of somebody lying to you, stealing to you, something they write in your relationship. So I'm gonna go ahead and clarify this tire tile. Mm, the tower, sorry. And you got two cards. You got the hermit where you go in and you go in within and think. But you also got the ten of swords where you blindfold and tied and there's nowhere to go. So maybe you feel bound in this situation or somebody else feel bound in this relationship because you're not seeing something. You tied it bound so you're not seeing what's going on. You're not seeing this deceit. And this is in your presence. Somebody's tied and bound and not seeing something. Universe spirit, guys, please clarify this ten of swords for my Libras. Please clarify the ten of swords. What came out is anxiety, nightmares, can't sleep, stress reverse. So you're going through something in some type of relationship. And this is your um, present situation. Two cards came out. Fuck it. I'm going to take them. Messages, emails, texting, calling. you about to get clarification on this shit. You got the third party situation. Now I could clarify. One person know about one person, the other person don't. Three of cups, your emotions all in check. But this also indicates it's a third party situation because in your in your future you got the three of wands straight up like that also. Then you got the six of pentacles when you trying to juggle or balance everybody. So it's something going on, but it was built on faulty foundation. So it's about to come tumbling down this third party situation. So I'm gonna clarify the page of swords real quick for you. Um, in reverse because you got the page of swords in reverse and um the page of swords reverse is usually when you want to have trouble with the police so power struggles in yours or at work is difficult to stay one head one head of the situation a fake is Basically, I'm going to say how the book says it. An imposter is found out. Somebody is faking your world, my Libras. And maybe that's why it's built on a faulty foundation. And it's about to come tumbling down. And bad luck and things not going in your favor. Because you got somebody in your circle that's fake. That ain't built on that solid foundation. And it might be somebody you hang with. Universe spirit guides. Please clarify... But you got the sun. The sun is the best card of the deck. Happiness, prosperity. But you see the horse, how he looking a little bit? You see how he looking on the side? It must be somebody around that ain't right. But you got the best card of the deck for your future after you get through all of this deceit. So with that being said, this is a third-party situation. Yep. 
And after the situation, you won't have happiness, harmony, family, life, and everything. But right now, you got to get through all this present. Something's about to come to come to a destruction in your present. Universe, spirit, guides. Perfection. You want everything right. But it don't go like that if somebody doing you a third party or you doing somebody a third party situation. Nothing's going to be a whole perfection. It don't work like that. Because one might not know about the other one, but one know. You got three cards that came out, so I'm going to read them to you. It says, be gentle, gentleness, trust. I trust that everything will be okay in the end, partly because I simply know it is in my gut, but also because it's way more fun to live with trust and confidence than to be a deficient wiener. Like somebody around you is an imposter and you trust in this person communication wonder how that other person is feeling ask them wish they knew how you are feeling tell them you just been drafted into the communication army where there is a strict to do ask do tell policy speak with kindness and gentleness and reach and understanding if you don't assumption will just make asses of everyone including the person who came up with that so basically somebody around you that you trust is an imposter. I'm telling you that now. And it already said your luck turning the opposite way, not which is bad luck. Things not going your way. So me personally, I'll be trying to find out who that imposter that's around me because you trusting them. And you got blindfolds on and the shark is trying to get you. You see that? You trusted somebody you don't supposed to trust to get them away from you. Universe spirit guides, please clarify what you want my Libras to know. Wow, it went right on the floor. I gotta get it and see what they want y'all to know. Yep, my Libras, y'all got somebody around y'all that's an imposter. You gotta get them from around you immediately because. You don't even know. It might be somebody you think you're cool, you working with. They they ch they shaking your hand, giving you a hug, telling you look nice, telling you they glad you're doing good. Them motherfuckers are straight out imposter. And you trust them too. Listen to this shit. You trust the snake. And you about to find out who it is. Probably through communication. And they said be gentle with it. You got gentle twice. So you got a snake around you. You got to get them out of there. Can't have a snake around you. There's enough going on. And this is to a couple of my cool ass levers I fuck with like that. Get them away from you, yo. That smiling, take your shaky hand, all that. Then you on some snake shit. And you blind to the fact because you ain't going to believe it. But they out on some other shit. Universe spirit guides. I just seen you pop up and taking you. Leadership. So you running your own shit. Take leadership and get them away. You don't need nobody else. Because after you get done, all that shit, just the ending card in your future. You're going to have happiness and everything. But you got to get away from, stop trusting this imposter. They around you heavy too. Because you blind. And they write it back you like a shark. You see that shit? You see that shit? That's deep. I'm trying to tell you. Get away from them. It could be somebody you with. But I feel as though this is this is somebody that 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 that's that's want to be a friend, that want to act like a friend. Universe spirit guide, give me a love reading for my levers. One more card, please. First card you got was worth waiting for. Divine timing is at work in your love life, so it's working something out. The second card you got, this could be the one you've already met the romantic partner you seek. Could be somebody you met, not sure. Next part you got was heart-to-heart -heart conversations. Honestly, discuss your feelings with each other. Something not going right in your relationships. Maybe it's time to have a talk. But with all that said, listen. You got a fraud that's around you, an imposter. You can't see that shit, but they right behind you on your heel. So there's somebody you dealing with, yo. And they on some grimy shit. 
and you trusting them. Get them the fuck away from you, yo. Good luck to all.